Hey guys, Fred Bowler here. Welcome to my channel, The Wildlife Ambassador. This video references alligators inhabiting salt water. If you're new to Florida or you've been in Florida and you just don't realize this, it is possible to see an alligator in, at the beach or in the intercoastal waterways, brackish water. The problem for the alligator is it just can't spend that long time compared to a crocodile. Um, alligators cannot get rid of the salt in their body and that can neg negatively affect them by retaining that salt and hurting their renal system, their kidneys and such. Where a croc, they have a lingual gl gland in their mouth and they can that actually bleeds off the salt uh, that is accumulated in their system from being in salt water. Not all crocodiles though, such as the crocodiles that inhabit primarily uh, fresh water such as the Nile crocodile or the slender snouted crocodiles and such. Um, however, the American crocodile and the saltwater croc or Indo-Pacific croc, um, they call those salties in Australia, those species can dispel the salt from their body um, using the lingual glands, so they're more adapted for full saltwater 